working with a query here that is counting the number of participants. I am counting on the ID field, um, and we're grouping by city. So it's going to take, give me a list of each city and how many participants are there are in that city. Since there is no criteria, I will be looking at all cities and all participants. I'm going to run this query, and I want to point out two things. First of all, the default column headings for ID, we were counting, and the column headings defaulted to count ID. We can change this. I'll show you how. And another thing is the first record, there's no city listed. That means there are eight records without an address. So if you required the address in your database when you were setting up table design, this wouldn't happen, and your data would be a little bit cleaner. Well, let's say we want to see all the cities but not the null. So I'm going to go back to the design view. And under city, under criteria, I'll type is not null. So you can group by and add criteria for those fields you're grouping. You can also add criteria for fields you're counting, summing, and doing statistical functions for. Okay, so we'll run that again, and you'll see that that null row is not there. Another thing that you can do is if you right mouse click on the field that you want to modify and go to properties, you will notice that there's a property sheet that's similar to the property sheets for fields when you were in table design. So if you don't want count of ID number to be your column heading, you can come up here to caption and I'll enter number of participants. Uh, which would be a better column heading. Another way to change your column headings is within the field row itself. I'm going to expand this and I will type capital city, okay, and a colon. Anything to the left side of the colon becomes the new field name if you were going to use this query for the basis of a report or for the basis of a program then the field name, even though it's using city from participants, becomes C-I-T-Y here. And anything to the right of the column is, as we have always been doing, the fields we're using. So we're going to run this, and you'll see capital city number of participants in the column headings. One other thing I want to do is if you wanted to limit the cities um, in a totals query, it is just the same as doing a regular query. So if I only wanted to see Moline or uh, East Moline, as we had done earlier, or Rock Island, I can type that criteria here in the criteria row and run it. And now I have a query for just those three cities.